I'm here in Yenbach, Austria, home of the Yenbacher gas engine, a high efficiency source of power capable of being fueled by natural gas, agricultural waste, even landfill trash. You ever look around at all the incredible technology in our world and think to yourself, how in the name of science does all this work? Me too. I'm Baratunde Thurston, and this is GE Masterclass. I'm Trevor Kirsten. I'm the lab manager for the Renewable Energy Systems Lab in Munich. On previous episodes, we learned how a jet engine works, we learned how a wind turbine works, and we got a very fun and clear phrase for that process. Suck, squeeze, bang, blow. Can you explain how a gas engine works and how it differs from that? It's got three similar steps. Okay. Suck, squeeze, bang. Okay. But this last step is different. It's kind of twist. Suck, squeeze, bang, twist. Correct. I like that. Break and the down. reason for that is that you're not wanting to create thrust, you're wanting to create torque. Yeah. So the first phase is suck. Normally you use turbochargers to blow pressurized air into the piston cavity. Then the piston drives up towards the head of the cavity, causing pressure. Then the bang happens. So normally in these engines, a spark plug would ignite, causing the fuel to burn. That converts to a lot of pressure, a lot of heat, which drives the piston down and then rotates the crankshaft, which is the twist phase. I understand this engine can be powered by various types of trash. What sort of trash can you feed the Yenbacher? So any trash that is, has the ability and the biological content to be digested to convert it into a methane or a burnable gas yeah. can be used. But it can come from a source where it's just been thrown away. So for example, in a landfill, it could be the waste of a farming production. So when you, you pick your corn and you're left with all of the husks, yes. you can convert that husks okay. into bio-waste. What about sewage? Yes. So sewage yes. has biological content. And as long as you... <laughs> that is the, the most <laughs> delicate way of describing sewage. I've got to keep it clean. Right? <laughs> Just like your engine. I yes. Guess. Yeah. Where there are humans, there's waste. Where there's waste, <laughs> there's gas. Where there's gas and a Yenbacher, there's power. So it's like the circle of energy. That was awesome. <laughs> you just nailed it. That was beautiful. It was like poetry. It was like, it was a power generation poetry. We've got to get smart around how we manage our resources. The world is a finite place. We have a finite forms of energy. We therefore must make sure that we do use that energy wisely. And I think Yenbacher plays an important role because it can burn waste fuels. I want to thank you. This was great. It was a pleasure to meet you. Nice meeting you too. And uh, thanks for your explanation. Uh, so what I need to do now is just keep clicking for more science. That way. <laughs>